This morning we're pulling another cool clutch here. This happens to be a ghost or what they would call hypo spinner. She's got one egg out right here and she's actually bred to a clown that's head for ghost. Half these babies should be hypo or what they would call ghost and then a whole bunch of combinations there up. Let's see how many eggs mama has. Like I said, one egg right here. Speaking of ghosts, I think the lights are going crazy here. So let's get these eggs inside. Like I said, we got one good egg here. Then we'll see what mama has here. Good clutch of eggs. Not just getting her off without her rolling the eggs all over the place. It's okay, mama. The eggs aren't stuck together, so I gotta pull them out separate. Nice clutch of eggs. There's no doubt about that. But interestingly enough, they aren't stuck together, which happens from time to time. Now, the reason eggs are stuck together typically is to keep them in a mass so they don't roll around because if you roll the embryo, it can kill the baby and drown it, right? So regardless, you've got two, four, six, eight, nine gorgeous eggs. I cannot wait for these. 57 days from now, we're going to be hatching, or actually later in this vlog. Right now, we're getting these into the incubator. The Kaboom Whopper. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo! How fast was that? Faster than a fort in a fan factory! But have you seen this? Whoa! Good job. That was fast. Dingo, you might have fast, fast venomous snakes. But you don't have two, four, six, seven heads in one turtle pond. Yeah, with only one, two, three, four turtles. Like how they're both trying to eat the same piece. It's like, just share, guys. Jeez. Just share. Lady in the tramp. Go spinner clutch in the incubator, going for another 57 days until we cut eggs. Really, these are all just going to be hat stuff, right? But there could be some cool ghost stuff that's actually hat for clown. That's kind of why I decided to show you this clutch. So again, about halfway through, we'll check them. 57 days, we're going to cut them later in the vlog, so make sure you stick around. Green Malta. Yeah, I got to cut this in a little bit smaller. Too. ka -chow. Frog. She's about to feed it first. Green Malta. Toad! Frog. No, it's a toad! Frog! How many toes does it have? No, not toes. You said toad. Yeah, that's, different that's than why a frog. they call it a toad. No, a toad it's a frog. Toes. It's a frog. One of the only reptiles with toes. Toad. It's not true at all. This clutch is really about the future, right? Because a ghost spinner, which would be a ghost pin spider, bred to a clown that's head for ghosts. Basically, we get a whole bunch of ghost combinations. They're all going to be head for clowns, so the future is really bright. We did have one egg start to go bad. Looks like it's not going to make it. Other than that, we have two, four, six, eight more eggs. So nine eggs late. Looks like eight made it. So tomorrow morning, we're going to find out what is actually in this clutch to raise up, really. Because I'm probably not going to sell a lot of them, to be honest with you. These are future breeders for sure, but I'm excited to see what's in these eggs. Welcome to Africa. I just ah, ah, ah. Oh, oh, God. I thought that anacondas are in like the Amazon. Why is it in Africa? Just gotta watch where you're walking through the bush, Mike. Hey, man, I wouldn't live that long. The black spinning car. Woo! How's the face on this one? God, he's pretty beautiful. Now feed that thing. Guys! Oh, Mike. You fed the one he wasn't filming. Right here. <laughs> Have another piece. One that sure. wasn't feeding. Dude, in the dark corner in the back. Nom, 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 nom. Decent night's sleep last night, thinking about these beautiful eggs, thinking what could we potentially produce in this clutch right here so that we can raise them up in three years from now, produce some incredibly banger animals. Let's head to the shop and cut some eggs. Woo! Wow, that cobra must be bowling because that was a strike. <laughs> no? Okay. Chinese banded king cobra onto the rodents. Guess he's not hungry. That is the craziest feeding technique. Watch the professional. <sighs> Oh, he's just yawning. <laughs> <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Get shamboozled, baby. That was, that was good. Once you just bored enough and it starts yawning, stick the food in his mouth. Woo! 
What? And the time has come. We're gonna find out what's going on with these. Again, everything in here is gonna be Het for Clown, right? And then all the ghost stuff, of course, is Het for Clown too. And that's what I'm really shooting for, the ghost or hypo stuff. It depends on what you want. You can call them either one, to be honest with you. And hopefully there'll be some good stuff in here. Right off the rip, we've got, let's see, just a literally a spider. Interestingly enough, this is what's interesting. This looks like an Enchi spider to me, which is not supposed to happen. I wonder if this ghost spinner actually has Enchi in it potentially, because that looks like what they would call a stinger bee. And of course, that's Het for Clown. I definitely want to get some hypo or ghost stuff in this clutch. That's for sure. I'd be happy right off the rip. Okay, we got a ghost. Unfortunately, it's just a normal ghost ball like that or hypo ball like that. But this is Het for Clown. So that's pretty cool. Now, at least for sure, we know, okay, there's definitely ghost stuff going on in the clutch. I always want to hit that first ghost because I'm like, all right, what's going on with that? Now, let's just hit some ghost combos. That will be Het for Clown. That will be amazing. Here we go. Come on, keep the ghost stuff coming, guys. Keep the ghost stuff. Nope. Looks like we've got another just spider ball python. Boy, our odds on that have been weird. Like I said, the first one looks like a singer, which is an Enchi. So there might be some Enchi stuff, but that one definitely is just a normal spider ball python. Hat for clown. All right, next egg up. Okay, looks like this one is actually just a spinner, not a ghost. So we've been missing on the ghost stuff, except for the one. It's just a spinner, but it is a hat for clown. So it's a spider, it's a pinstripe, and it's hat for clown. Okay, number five. Let's see what we got here. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, it's a ghost for sure. And it's a ghost spinner. Oh, that's a pretty one too. This is a ghost spinner. Of course, hat for clown. That's what I was really hoping for. If I could get ghost spinner, hat for clown, that'll be something I'll probably raise up and breed to future stuff just to get, you know, again, all the ghost stuff. You know, you can get ghost clowns, you get ghost spinner clowns, ghost pinstripe right clowns, ghost spider clowns, all kinds of different stuff. We've got three eggs to go. Here we go. So that last egg was definitely the egg I was wa waiting for, for sure. All right, not bad, not bad. This is actually a ghost pinstripe that's hat for clown. So I'll take that for sure. That's another good animal for sure. Now let's hope that they turn out to be females. We'll find out later in the vlog when they hatch out. We'll not only see them, but we'll go ahead and sax them out and find out because I really want to keep the females. Here we go. Two more eggs to go. And looks like another spider. But again, it looks like another Enchi spider, which is really interesting. Looks like an Enchi spider hat for clown. Last egg. Last good egg. I should say there is one bad egg and I'm gonna go ahead and cut it just to see what's inside there and this is unfortunately just a normal ball python that's head for clown just a normal clown so we got some really cool stuff as far as the ghost stuff goes not as many as I really would have hoped but hey when did you ever get that I wanted them all to be ghost right now of course this is an egg that smells absolutely horrible and when they look like this this typically tells me that there was a baby inside of it and that it died at some point during incubation you never know it could be a two-headed snake for all we know right so let's go ahead and see what's in this stinky egg Oh, right off the bat. Oh, that just does not sound or feel good at all. Uh, and you can see massive deformity here. Oh, that's so gross. There is literally just one head, but look at how that, it almost looks like a seahorse. There's just a massive deformity in this one. Absolutely disgusting. Uh, that, oh gosh, that smells so bad, guys. So we'll wait for these guys to hatch out. Woo -hoo. I tell you, that's horrible. We'll wait for these to hatch out. We'll show you guys here in a minute when they're hatched out so we can actually look at them. We'll sex them out. And then later in the vlog, you're actually gonna see them shed out and how beautiful they are. And the Ethiopian mountain adder, one of the rarest snakes you find anywhere in the world. I didn't think it was that fast. Oh, Dingo! Dingo! Whoa! Oh, oh, what are you oh, doing? Oh, get in control of your Cobra, man! That's Whoa. way too close. That's way too close. Put it away. All right, we're, we're actually closed. Yeah. I see you guys are fans with all that merch on and stuff. Yeah, it's been 25 years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let it go. Oh, you know, peachy. It's food time, right? And these guys are all hatched out and shed out. Now, this is actually a spinner ball python, which is a pinstripe and a spider, but it's also a hat for clown and it's hat for ghost. Then we have a little ghost ball python, a recessive morph here that is 100% hat for clown. Then we have another single gene animal here, which is just a spider ball python, but again, it's carrying the trait for ghost and for clown. Then we have a ghost pinstripe, which is the recessive hypo or ghost and the incomplete dominant pinstripe. And oh my gosh, is this a feisty little monkey here? And it's 100% hat for clown. And then interesting 
interesting enough, when I cut this, I actually thought it was just a spinner ball python. Turns out that this is actually a ghost spinner ball python. So it's a hypo ghost, it's a spider, and it's a pinstripe, and it's 100% hat for clown. Awesome to see that beautiful clutch all hatched out. Speaking of out, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also, hit that like button while you're down there. <laughs> God, that's pretty beautiful.